Okay, so I tried the wig on. I just plopped it on my head. Hey guys, welcome to my channel. Hey guys, welcome to my channel. I was supposed to take you out with me today. I went to shop for a new girlfriend, aka wig. <laughs> so I found one. It's a 360 free part lace front Persian version Remy 100% human hair um, this is a wet and wavy style you can flat iron it to get it straight or you could wet it to make it wavy or you could just have it you know it could be puffy it could be just a natural wavy curl if you wet it and put some mousse in it but it's um, four inches of lace in the front and it's a 360 lace all the way around it's unprocessed you can dye bleach or perm it and this is by Motown Trust and this is the box here you can see Motown Trust 360 360 lace Persian Remy, I think it's 18 inches. But I had to treat myself. The, the wigs I've been pulling out the box are just actually done. I need to just throw my whole box away. I'm going to take my time and kind of pluck the hairline a little bit and you know it comes in a little net on the box it has some instructions on hair care how to take care of this unit but it doesn't say how long it is I want to say it's about 18 inches. Let me take it out. It is actually beautiful hair. Persian hair. I got this in the um, natural color. This is the lace. The lace is a little tinted. And maybe a little makeup and this will be okay. So the inside of this unit has three combs. Two on the side. One in the back with some adjustable straps. And the lace goes all the way around. Which I generally would not use the lace in the back. But it's a fair amount of parting space. I like it just so I could part it on the side or in the front. But this is the unit here. I was looking at a different one with Remy hair instead of Persian hair. And the texture was a little bit softer. But I do like the fact that I can do three different styles with this wig. You know, I can leave it like this, just shaking and go, or I can wet it and have it, you know, a, a nice wavy wet look, or I can get my straightening comb and straighten it out. But I'm going to go ahead and try to customize it a little bit. But first, let me try it on right off the box. Give me one minute. Okay, so I tried the wig on. I just plopped it on my head. It has this baby hair here. You know, if companies would 
give us less unnecessary lace and give us a, be a better quality of lace, I think, you know, it'll probably be a lot better. But I do like it. But I also, I do want to customize it. Let me see if I can zoom in a little bit. Because it is pretty thick around the, the sides. This is the top part. Huh. It's not too bad. I hope you can see. But I like it. I like the length. I like the fullness. So if I want to wear it big, I would like it like this. And just wear it straight out with no parts or anything in it. But I'm planning on doing something this weekend. And I really need it. A new unit I mean I needed a new unit whether I do anything or not but I do like this and if I want to put a side part in there or middle part and then I have a comb they actually gave me these as a free gift so I can use this rat tail comb And make me a little part here. So I'm not, yeah, I might just pluck it a little around the hairline and cut down a baby hair. And I'll let you know how it turns out after I cut the lace off. Okay, guys, I'll see you later. Now, something I noticed about this wig that it has short pieces here and then it's long. I don't know if that's because of the way it's customized, but it's short pieces like around the top part here. The hair is like shorter here. All this is shorter. Can't see, I'm taking the camera everywhere. All this is shorter and then, then the rest of it. And I don't know why it's like that. But I'm gonna go ahead and see if I can fix it up and I'll be back. All right guys, so this is my sorry attempt to pluck the lace <laughs> I am really not good at that stuff but I think I'm gonna have to go in a little bit more but the hair looks good after I wet it it looks pretty good I haven't cut the lace yet in the front because I want to go back and pluck it a little bit more. So it could look a little bit more natural, but I love the waves in here. It's really nice. Get it in the light. All right, I'll be back. So this pretty much is how it looked after I finished going back with and plucking the lace. And I also dyed the lace and cut the lace and kind of poofed it out a little bit. And this is the result of that. I'm showing you the lace that I dyed. And here I just sprayed it with water, only water. I just spritzed it down with water and left it alone.
Hey guys, I'm back with my new unit. Um, actually, this wig been on my wig here since the last time y'all saw it. Uh, when I just took a video of it being, you know, puffed out, it just after I've tried to do a little customizing, I don't know what I'm doing, y'all. So it ain't that good. Um, and I also showed a video when it was wet with water i love it i like it at first i was you know a little iffy about it because of the way that it was cut but it looks pretty good so what i did um with my little customizing is i sprayed the lace with this sally hansen airbrush legs and i got the color tan glow i think i'm gonna have to go back with a little bit more because i didn't want to overdo it and they get like in the hair and stuff but i noticed a little bit that did get in the hair it was really easy to get off so um the lace look okay but i just want to go in for a little bit more and then i want to put some put some holding spray on there they also said you could use got to be spray but i think i might make it a little too hard and um the lace wasn't that bad so i don't want to mess it up by putting a whole bunch of stuff on there but i'm going to spray some of this on there and i'm actually going to let it dry because i put it on my wig head and my wig head is full of this tan spray so i got that and that's done but this is my you know my wet and wavy a couple days later i haven't had it on just had it sitting there um so um but i like it i like it the hair is really good is um is soft even you know because all i did was spray it with water i don't have any other chemicals in there any mousse or nothing like that um i am planning on doing something this weekend so i may you know put some mousse in it so it could stay you know like a little bit curly but i actually like it i like it big and if it get bigger i like it like that too so i will try to straighten it out it won't be anytime soon but when i do i'll let y'all know that it is this unit um because it is three different styles the puffed out style you know and the the wet and wavy look when it's actually look like it's wet and straighten so i like this unit again it was motown Tress 360 persian version remy 100 percent human hair and it's a 360 lace wet and wavy and it is some lace in the bag more likely i won't use that because you know I, I, if i put my hair back it's just gonna you know you're not gonna need the lace i ain't think nobody do but um i like it i like it after i got it i was looking at youtube and i saw a review and it was actually the same box but it was a completely different hair that was in there they only had like a lace part in it and it said that it was 360 and the girl said it didn't tint well it you know and it didn't even wave up good so um yeah i don't think that was the same hair that i have even though you know it is store-bought hair i still would suggest if you buying a wig go ahead and get it online check out the reviews and all that stuff first because if i had saw that review and then went to the store and i saw that i wouldn't have got it but it's that that they had on that website is not the same one that i have on my head today this is um a full lace front is um four inches by i think 13 inches where it comes all the way around um it's, of course it's not that much lace here but it is um it goes back to here the lace goes to here and down and hers has had a part on it so um that's my review i like it you know i'm not the best as customizing and stuff like that i, I don't even have it glued down y'all just put it on so i could do this video so i try to do a little customizing and stuff like that on the 
on the hairline. I don't think I did too bad, but of course I think I could, it could be better, but it won't be me to do it. Maybe I could have someone else customize it for me. Um, but out of 10, I give this a good, a good nine. I have no complaints about it. So far, so good. All right, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Please comment, like, and subscribe to my channel, guys. I see y'all watching. Comment and like and subscribe to my channel. All right, guys. I'll see you next time. Bye.